Okay, so what is once again up, everybody on YouTube? This is Two Bros Gaming HD coming straight at you with yet again another video this Monday evening. I hope that you guys are ready for it, and I hope you are stoked for yet again some new stuff right here from the old Two Bros Gaming HD. If you're not yet a subscriber to the channel, please go ahead and subscribe to it. We are pretty freaking close and getting to. 27,000 subscribers, so if you want to join the community, you can just go ahead and click the red button under this video. Let's get into this and let's go ahead and see what we can actually do today that would be pretty freaking lit. Today, as you probably already know, we got a lot of new mods, which is basically the ones that I'm going to go ahead and take a look at in this video. So we're going to go into mods right here. We're going to go to the newest section, which I am basically at right now. And today we got the Kuhn GA8521 Wind Rower and we also got the Krenlin Extractor EL Package. And without further ado, we also got a Roar Unimat 660. I think that the FS09 Dark House and the Kasha Wash House is also some new additional things that actually came out today. Uh, if you have my purest opinion on that, of course. So, uh, yeah. But of course, the FS19 Doll range or ranch has actually been out there or online right now for some time. And basically what this is all about is that you can go ahead and check out my latest video on that one because basically in that video I'm gonna go ahead, kind of like I am taking a look at the newest mod out there which is as I want to actually say pretty freaking lit so please go ahead and do that of course check out the latest video from tubers gaming HD uh, yeah Let's get into this and go ahead and download the new mods today because I'm gonna go ahead and show them to you in this video. So we're gonna go ahead and take the Kuhn GA right here, which is from Fabian slash Gogo Beer. This has a price of 17,000 euros and a max working speed on 20 kilometers per hour. The required power on this is 70 horses under the hood. Working width is 8.2 meters, which is pretty cool for a wind roll like this. Then we have this call to it right here from Turbo Gamer. This is a raw Unimat 660 and it is designed for high quality preparation of the soil for sowing precise crops, moisture, closing, provides high quality loosening and the creation of a bed for seeds. The manufacturer of this is raw as you probably already know and the model is a Unimat 660. The price of this is 12,000 euros. It has a working width on 6.6 .6 meters. The required power on this is 150 horses under the hood. It has a max working speed on 13 kilometers per hour which is also pretty dope indeed. Then we have the Quinlan Exacta EL package, which is this little fertilizer sprayer thing. And it is from Mifius FS, or Mifius. Price is 4,000 euros and it has a capacity from 700 liters to 100 liters, actually. So that is pretty cool. It has a working width on 15 meters, so that is also cool in, indeed. So that is kind of what we're gonna go ahead and take a look at in this video. I have it all down and already. Let's get into career mode and let's go to the safe game that I am mainly using right here. Deselect all and select all and let's go ahead and start out the game. So right now, while we are waiting for the game to load, you can probably go ahead and hit the red button under this video if you haven't done that yet. Because, guys, we are, as I said earlier in the video, pretty freaking close on hitting those 20 or 27 subscribers, 27,000 subscribers on the channel. It would be pretty cool to hit it, actually, I have to say. So, yeah, join the bros today, of course. Join okay, the freaking so bros. That would be lit up, I guess, actually. Or oh, it actually would, yeah. <laughs> Um, so it's 95% right here for the loading section, which is uh, pretty dope, if you ask me. And um, right there, we're ready to go ahead and start it up. Start it up, 
And we are basically gonna go into the shop, of course. We're gonna, oh, that was the start game. We're gonna go to the shop, which I am at right now. We're gonna go to the brand and it is raw that I'm gonna look for at first. Or actually, I'm just gonna take it as uh, kind of like, what can you say, models. So if you're gonna go into cultivators right here, we can go ahead and take the raw. It should be down here somewhere. It is right here, the Unimat 600. Gonna go ahead and take it. You can only take it all standard. So that's probably the one that I'm gonna take. Then we want the wind rower right here from Kuhn, the Kuhn GA 8521 right here. Let's go ahead and see if we can find that. It is right here. You can take different kind of designs on this with, with a flap in the middle and just without anything. So yeah, I'm just gonna take it with a flap, deselect or, or kind of, I'm just gonna take it all standard. Just design two actually, that's pretty cool. Then we are gonna go into the category of fertilizer technology, because in here we do have the Krillin Exactor and it is the EL package. So I think it is right here, but we do also have this and those are pretty freaking similar. Uh, and they're both mods, so I don't know. But this right here, you can actually take it to extension 1000, which is one tons. The other is 700 kilograms and stuff like that. We're gonna just gonna go ahead and take it one ton because that's just how we do it, of course. Um, yeah. So I just want to get over to. Uh, I just need to buy a vehicle so I can get over to the store to actually go ahead and take a look at the newest mods in Farmers Mirror 2019, of course. It would be pretty lit, I have to say. So we over here right now, which is basically what I'm gonna go ahead and focus about. So right here at the, f or kind of in front of the store, we do have the newest vehicles in this game and it is pretty cool with all these different kind of things. Also, we got the Fiat right there, the Fiat 1300 DT. Isn't it a DT? Yes, it is, because it's dual track or something like that. So here we have the newest mod of the additional family or the family to the to the kind of farm summary 2019. The cultivator right here, the wind brewer, and of course the fertilizer sprayer. We're gonna go ahead and take the Fiat 1300 DT and I'm gonna go ahead and actually put that little cultivator on the back of it to see what it actually looks like. It would be pretty cool if it looks pretty dope, which I surely hope it does, or which I think it does uh, right here. But I think maybe, no, it's not. Maybe it's not. I just wanted to say, oh, I was pretty close in saying that maybe it's too big for this tractor, but um, I just want to take that back because I don't think it is too big for this tractor. The tractor actually handles it pretty good. Maybe the tractor just needs a little bit of a front weight in front of it. That would be uh, that would probably be a, a good thing if uh, if it had that, uh, of course, because then it would probably not gonna go ahead and be so light in the back of it as it is right now, as you can probably see. Uh, I would probably bet that if I went like this and if I go forward, uh, almost, you can see the front wheels are uh, basically sliding like that. It, it doesn't have much traction in the front of the wheels. It really doesn't have that much of traction in the front of the wheels, which is a little bit strange, everything compared to stuff like that and so on, but it's okay at the moment. Um, yeah, it really, really is. So right here, it's also a pretty big cultivator, but it is this like old cultivator thing. I'm just gonna take it off actually. Uh, and eventually I'm gonna go ahead and take the wind rower on the back instead of that cultivator thing, because we're gonna go ahead and see the differences from the wind rower or kind of as this, because I also think that the Fiat 1300 DT would fit okay. Oh Jesus, would fit okay with this uh, wind rower. Let's go ahead and put it all the way down to the ground, and it, it's not wider than the, the cultivator at, at all. It, it really isn't, uh, as you can see right here. 
and so on so it is basically just as you see it right here i'm gonna fold it again because we don't want it to be like unfolded and stuff like that when we're just out here sitting on the driveway of this station thing so that's pretty cool at the moment so yeah those are kind of like the newest mods that we got at the moment today of course we also got the new map and stuff like that but at the moment these are just the things that we do have and i said i have to say that it is pretty cool to see these other kind of different kind of things in the gameplay as we know it so that's kind of pretty dope uh, i just want to say once again Thanks for watching right here on Tubers Gaming HD once again. And uh, please go ahead and support the channel by hitting the thumbs up on this video or make sure to subscribe to the channel by clicking the red subscribe button under this video as always. Thanks for watching and thanks for coming through. We're going to see you guys later. Bye guys. Bye.